Hey everybody, we got my retro glasses on right here. We got my NES controller right here. There's that NES game up there. Must be time for some more NES action. NES fun. <laughs> Today we're looking at the Blues Brothers video game. It's based on the you know skit Saturday Night Live skit, I believe, and a uh, movie. Came out on everything under the sun. I PC Amstrad, if you've ever heard of that. If you were in the US, probably not. Maybe, maybe not. Commodore, Atari, NES, Super Nintendo eventually, Game Boy. Uh, all came out in 91, 92. SNES came out in 93. Um, made by a company called Titus. It's kind of like Chip and Dale. Kind of not, because Chip and Dale's really good, and this is okay. You run around and jump and throw boxes, like Chip and Dale, granted, but. The two-player uh, mechanic, it's okay. The game's okay. That's, that's just, uh, let's just check it out. It's the official licensed product from Broadway Video. Yeah, story. Can you swim your way through a department store or unmask a goggled shark? Control-wise, it's pretty responsive. Uh, you know, I'm not feeling any lag or any of those issues. That makes sense. You better run, though, you didn't have that chip there. You press all the beat up like Mario. And you can start it in the air. I don't know what it is those are, but they're flying around and trying to hurt me. expect you to you know, be accurate at that after the everybody get a use test and get better at it as you go along. So far I haven't gotten any weapons, so I'm just jumping at the point. What the hell? I guess it's fine. It's kind of blues brothery music. I can extend the time by the Alright, I jumped on the line of water, but so is the top.
position. The water jumps, the rain jumps, you know. Just it feels so different. Pause no tone and just let you listen to music over and over But, uh, okay, so. It is kind of a runny, jumpy platforming. There are lives and hits. Um, the graphics aren't too bad. Uh, backgrounds are a little bland, at least as far as I've gotten. Music gets repetitive. The sound effects are kind of non existent. And it just. Play Chip and Dale. Or something else. I mean, the fact that there's, there's no defensing, you know, defensive. No ability to defend yourself kind of sucks. Um, I guess that's kind of the point is you're avoiding, you know, the Blues Brothers didn't go around beating guys up that often or anything like that, but still. And, and you, know, you can chalk it up to, yeah, it's difficult, but it seems kind of pointlessly difficult. I mean, it just it doesn't feel that fun to me to warrant wanting to try and beat it. So, Blues Brothers, and no thanks. But until next time, Mr. Sunglasses, play some NES. Oh yeah.